In our episode on animals and their environments, we learned that animals will change their environment to meet their needs. One need of all animals is that they need food to survive. So an animal will change their environment in order to find food. Today, we're going to play a game and we're going to see if we can match the animal to their food. For this game, you're going to need six plates, a spoon, some tweezers, a binder clip, rubber bands, beads, and toothpicks. Ronnie's rule for this game is to not tip the plate because that is cheating. We should be able to figure out which animal belongs to each type of food by looking back at the data that we collect during our game. I'm going to start off with my spoon and time myself for 30 seconds each. And in those 30 seconds, I'm going to see how many rubber bands I can pick up, how many beads I can pick up, and how many toothpicks I can pick up. Then I'm going to repeat those steps using the tweezers and the binder clip. Based on my findings, I've determined that the spoon worked best for the beads, the tweezers worked best for the rubber bands, and the binder clip worked best for the toothpicks. Try it yourself and compare. Did your findings match our findings? Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time on another episode of Miss Shelley's Science Show.